Welcome! In this video, we're going to explain the difference between time slots and shifts and how to set them up for your event. Before we begin, make sure you're logged in. Please navigate to your organization's management page and create a new event. If you need a refresher on how to do this, please watch our How to Create an Event video tutorial. The primary difference between time slots and shifts is whether or not the volunteer can set their own hours. If you choose to add time slots, when volunteers are registering for the event, they can sign up for a subset of hours within the blocks you pre-assigned. You can create time slots right inside the Basic Details tab. When you select the time slot option, you'll be asked to confirm the minimum duration of the time slot volunteers can sign up for, the number of slots per time slot, and the total number of participants per block of time. When registering for your event, volunteers will see a calendar with the open time slots they can sign up for. After they choose their slot, they will see a pop-up window which includes any registration questions for the event. Unlike time slots, shifts are only for preset blocks of time. When a student signs up for a shift, they are committing for that entire block of time. To add shifts, first choose the shift option in the rightmost dropdown when designating the event type. After you click the blue Save and Continue button on the Basic Events tab, you'll see a new tab open up in the left-hand side bar. In this new Shifts tab, you'll create the shifts for your event. To do this, click the blue Actions button in the upper right-hand corner, and then click Add New Shift. On this page, you'll be asked to title the shift, set the shift time and duration, and specify how many people can sign up for that shift. Once you've added all the details, be sure to click the blue Submit button at the bottom of the page. Repeat this process for as many shifts as you need, and then continue on creating the event. When volunteers click on your event page, they'll see the green register button like normal. As they click through the registration questions, they will be prompted to sign up for specific shifts. Here's a summary of the steps to add time slots or shifts to your event. A written summary will also be available in the description. If you're interested in watching any of these additional tutorials, please click the title now. Thank you for watching this video. If you run into problems or have any difficulties, please don't hesitate to reach out and contact us.